There we go. I think we're ready to go. Are we all sorted out? How does that look? Camera, are you happy? <laughs> Perfect. So, I'm gonna go through some simple, normal question type things. And I like, I like this interview. I don't have to crouch down like I have done with other people in the past. Like, usually they were... No, don't, stay, stay up, stay up. Yeah. It's, it's, uh, it's uh, nice to be able to like, get some of the height again. Although I kind of feel like short with you. Sorry. I'm, I'm a bit like, actually, yeah, just go down a little bit. Just go down a little. There we go. That's better. I see, look, now I'm like <laughs> taller, so that makes it yeah, okay. Sorry, it's even. There we go. Sorted. So anyway, yeah. Um, just some standard basic questions, really. Are you ready? I am. Cool. Right, let's do this. So, hello. Uh, we are here with... Lisa Marie. And you are today cosplaying as... Amy Pond from Doctor Who. There we go. Awesome. Now, unfortunately, I've got something to admit to you right now. Right. I don't watch Doctor Who. Right. Starting well. So, uh, yeah, I know. I should have probably gone through this earlier. Like, I've, like done some backstory of who are you and what do you do. And so I can ask you <laughs> interesting things about Doctor Who because I'm sure there's people out there who are going to be like, oh, yeah, I watch Doctor Who. But I've... Yeah, I, uh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm really, really, really sorry. So, uh, who, who, what does she, what does she do in Doctor Who? For those people who don't watch Doctor Who, what does Amy Pond do? Wow, that's an open question. Well, she's gone now. She's not the current companion anymore. But when uh. she was the companion, she had a brilliant backstory because it was all to do with the Doctor abandoned her as a child, and she uh. had, yeah, she had issues. So the Doctor's a bit of a bit of a dick. Yeah, for now. <laughs> yeah. um, and then he came back. Um, when she was 21 and then she went off with him you know oh so it was like she was like daddy you're home let's go I don't mind that you left me let's just go because you're the doctor yeah let's just leave it yeah uh, okay. <laughs> is there like an, a, a couple of episodes devoted to this event of him like popping back going come on love let's go or is it like this episode ah. yeah because the whole Apple thing is to do with it's basically his way of proving time travel oh okay yeah because so, he's still fresh when he comes back and collects her like 10 years later or whatever. Oh, okay. Yeah. Gotcha. See, I was curious about the apple because yeah. I, I'm not a who. Who are they? Whovians? Whovian. Whovian. Yeah, yeah, I'm not a Whovian. But I do know the term Whovian. <laughs> so. The correct term. For exactly. The I know the terminology, but unfortunately, I don't really like watch it, I'm afraid. So, uh, is this your first LFCC or are you a regular or what do you, what's your like involvement with LF LFCC and other cons around the world? This is my fourth LFCC, I think. I'm here as a cosplay rep this yeah? time. Ah. I don't really know what that means. What does, I was gonna say, what does that entail? <laughs> you're like, well, you're rep, you're a representative of cosplay, so you're like, this is cosplay. Kind this of, is what we do. I think. Yeah. yeah. It means that I got in and I get a place to put my stuff. See, bonus, <laughs> like, like lockers or exactly. Yeah. That's... See, that's why you need to become reps so you get lockers, storage for it's things. Useful. And then, but I've done. I do too many cons. Too yeah. many cons. I've done. Is there such a thing as too many cons? Yeah. <laughs> Apparently there is. There is. <laughs> uh, just this month I've got four, I think. Well, that's, well, that's inconsiderate. <laughs> yeah. Can you be quiet, please? We're interviewing. Thank no, you. No, 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 no. Not you. Oh, now, now we're getting everyone else involved. No, not you. It's the man on the, the speaker. It's okay. It's okay. Yeah. Awkward. Uh, so yeah. Anyway, too many well, cons. Too many uh, yeah. Uh, no, this month I think I've got four, and I do too many. I just all my friends are here, so this is like my only chance to see them. Exactly. So. See, look, friends. Cons bring true. friends together. It really is true. These people are people that you I could say that with. cons are quite pro oh, for friendship. Oh no. Oh no, that was bad. I'm, I'm quite oh, proud of that. That, that, that was, was good. good, that is good. But really bad as well. Yeah? Yeah. Just trying to think, what was my first con? Ah, my first con I went to, I think I was probably 12. Wow. And get this it. out, it was a Decepticon. No, no, I'm, no, this is serious. It was called a Decepticon and it was a Transformers convention. That's I'm not like, I'm not making a terrible joke. I thought you were joke. taking the piss then. No, 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 <laughs> seriously, I've got the lanyard at home. I'll find it and I'll put it in this video to prove to you. I'll be okay. like, insert picture of Decepticon lanyard here. And it's also got my name on it. So when you see this, you're going to be like, oh my God, I'm so sorry. Wow. Well, I hope you'll be like that. That's... Well, I might take a picture of it tonight and show you it tomorrow and then we can re-interview and you could be like it's, it was I want mine, to, yeah. you could do a formal apology <laughs> for taking the okay. nick out of my Decepticon convention. True. But it was well good. I bought a Grimlock. I don't know what that is. Do I should I leave now? <laughs> I think you should I think you should go. He's like the leader of the he's like the leader of the Dinobots. I was never really into Transformers. So. She was never into Transformers. I've, I've seen and she had a go at me for not knowing Doctor I know, Who. But I Oh, blimey. Okay, we're even now. There we go, I'd say that. So have you got any other cons lined up in the future? Uh, in, the, in the next few weeks I've got Expo, 
Where's that? At London XL. Oh, okay. Uh, Collector Mania Milton Keynes in Milton Keynes. Uh, uh, I got told about that yeah. and uh, I think I'm going to go. I don't know if I'm going to fun. cosplay for it, but uh, it's really chill. Yeah, it's really quite chill con. It's a chill con. It is a chill con. Chill con. Yeah. Yeah. Also, it's really cold. So yeah. Oh, that's well, that's good because it's really hot. It's, it's so really hot, hot here hot, today. Yeah. It is. It for is boiling winter, hot. Winter London Film and Comic Con. It's exactly, really hot. Exactly. Yeah. Well, I'm just going to press, press you. Hold on a moment. Yeah. There we go. Cool. So I got this camera yesterday. Did oh, I get it yesterday? Right. Was it yesterday? Did I get you yesterday? Something like that. Damn. Maybe. No. I can't remember. It's not really relevant, I suppose. Anyway. So I'm still playing with it. I'm what do you think of it? Is it pretty? It's nice. It's a good camera. Yeah. I well, like... I know squat about cameras, but it, lo it looks pretty. It kind of looks like it knows what it's doing. It does, and this rotating screen's useful for this. Exactly, yeah, because then we can look it's at it. Fix my and hair. then we can like get distracted and go like, oh yeah, oh is it yeah. still. Oh no, that's okay. It's just like awkward. I don't know. I'm getting used to it still. Do you like my pro microphone I as do. well? I do, it's brilliant. It is, it is, look, it's, it's going to be out of focus, but it's the tiniest it's thing. It's the tiniest microphone I've ever seen. It's tiny, but, it's but it works. It's really it's supposed to have like a, a little clip thing, um, but uh, I lost it because I did use it on my previous camera and it was terrible on it. Ah. But now it's quite good. Okay, it's good. Um, so cons. cons, back to cons. Yeah. Here we go. We're, we're back on track we're back on again. Track. So uh, off, but we're okay. what made you decide to dress up as? Um, okay, I started going to conventions because I'm a fan of sci-fi and fantasy and comic books and so on. Yeah. About five or six years ago, and then when I came to my first LFCC. I saw all these people in. Uh, actually, saw Emmy, Fairy Porch Queen, dressed as Wonder Woman, ah. and I was like, "Yeah, she looks amazing. I want to have a go at that." Wicked. So, yeah. Good stuff. There we go. Awesome. And uh, oh yeah, I asked this one question before. If I was to cosplay, uh -huh. who should I cosplay as? Who would you recommend for me to cosplay as? Crap. <laughs> so I'm just gonna come in like a poo costume. No, Great, I hate thanks. This question, people ask me this question all the time, and. I don't know, it depends what your fandoms are. You can't really cosplay from something that you don't like. Uh, well, I play League of Legends. There you go. What are the League of Legends? I don't know League of Legends. So, oh, you don't like Doctor Who, huh? Oh. I don't play League of Legends or no Transformers. Oh, it looks like the other shoes on the other foot. I know, other foot. It's, uh, it's, yeah. Sorry. It's all right, I forgive you. Thanks. Thanks. So, uh, yeah. I'll uh, thank you very much for your time. Enjoy the con. Thank you. And uh, yeah, we shall re interview tomorrow. And I'll have my Decepticon badge thing from back in the day. And then you'll feel sorry. I can't believe you went to that con when you were 12. I, mean, wow. I might have been 12. It was like a family type thing. But um, yeah, I was also on Antiques Roadshow with Transformers. Wow. Because my brother had a collection and it was the Christmas special. And uh, yeah, so check me out. TV for it as well. <laughs> See you later. Thank you, you very much. Bye. Bye. There we go. Cool. I don't feel that small. <laughs> I like the dramatic stand dramatically again. And now that's that's I think that's but an acceptable height. height. Okay, yeah, stand, yeah, yeah, the dramatic standing. So okay. we are here again today with Lisa Marie. And today you are cosplaying Black Widow or Natasha Romanoff. Uh, I, I'm kind of standing as well. I think I'm mimicking your epic <laughs> stance for some reason. I've got it's my, the hand on the hip. It is. It is. It's just it comes naturally to me. <laughs> I think. So uh, yesterday. Yep. We were talking about cons and things. We were. And uh, you thought I was taking a joke when I said I went to a Decepticon when uh, I was little. Yeah. I thought and that pun was just a bit too... It wasn't a pun, it wasn't a pun, and I've brought my proof today, I took a picture of my past. There you go, look. Oh, wow. Decepticon, Sunday the 3rd of September. Decept look at that. Is it, se yes, it is September? Wow. See? I don't know what year, it doesn't say the year. It's, but yeah, it's, it's official. It looks Decepticon. quite old. <laughs> so, uh, we're gonna get, I think we're gonna get an official apology, are we? Yeah, okay, I'm very... Straight. Straight to camera. I am very sorry. I make it really emotional. I disbelieved. I don't, I don't believe this apology. Like, yeah. re I'm, I'm talking like really genuinely sorry. I'm so sorry. Okay, that's more like there it. We well, there you go. See, I am a veteran. I was going to cons before, you know, you even probably started doing cons, so. Yeah, probably. There you go. Yeah. Awesome. Well, thank you very much even for your time. This is your first con in well, quite it's, a long it's time. It's not my. in a long time, but the first con I went to. Decepticon. Was a Decepticon, yeah, and she's jealous because she couldn't go. A little bit. Exactly, see? <laughs> but thank you for your time again, thank it's you. been awesome, and uh, yeah, go enjoy the world, Black Widow. Thanks. See you later. See you later. 
I told her I went, but would she believe me? No.